to Sports, sponsored by your Oklahoma Ford dealers. Oh, this should be fun. According to ESPN's Adrian Wojnarowski, Kevin Durant will play in Game 5 tonight for the Golden State Warriors in the NBA Finals versus the Raptors. Durant hasn't played since May 8th due to a calf injury. Last time the Warriors were down three games to one in a series was 2016 versus Durant's OKC Thunder. And what's going on, everybody? Welcome into sports with hopes of making their next trip to Omaha. Oklahoma State baseball season coming to an end yesterday in Lubbock, Texas. The Pokes losing to Texas Tech 8-6. to six. They did hold a lead three separate times, including a two-run lead in the eighth inning thanks to a Colin Simpson home run. But Tech came back to score four runs thanks to two homers, and then they closed it out in the ninth. Tulsa native Trevor Boone did hit his 21st home run of the season. Bixby native Kate Cavanis hit his eighth homer. Jinx native Brett Stanley pitched three innings and let up three runs. A disappointing end to the Cowboys season. Even though we lost the game today, we won the season because we achieved real team. And uh, you can't say that every year you put on your uniform. So that being said, congratulations to Texas Tech and we'll, uh, we'll go back to work getting ready for next year. It was announced today that the BOK Center will be hosting Tulsa and Oklahoma State men's basketball as part of the BOK Center basketball showdown doubleheader on December 21st. The Golden Hurricane will face off against Colorado State for the first time since 1999, and the Pokes will play Minnesota. That'll be cool for new OSU signees Memorial Zone, Keelan and Caleb Boone. And it was a great weekend for Tulsa Tough 2019. We saw Sam Bassetti win the men's pro Omnium capped off by his win at Crybaby Hill. Emily Roper's win at Crybaby Hill on the women's side helped give Rock Salt Attack their second straight 1-2 team finish. Sam Schneider, who won the Blue Dome District on Friday, claimed her third pro victory. 